Hello everyone. Welcome to MSFT webcast. In this video, you will learn the steps on how to join Windows 11 computer to an Active Directory domain. After setting up an Active Directory domain controller in our network, we can then join one or more Windows 11 computers to the Active Directory domain. The Windows 11 AD join process adds a computer to Active Directory domain, allowing the computers to access the resources within the domain. Please remember that we can join a Windows 11 computer to Azure Active Directory over the internet if your company provides that facility. But in this video, we will consider the local domain setup only. If you want to join client computer to a domain, first you will need a Windows 11 computer running Windows 11 Professional, Enterprise or Education Edition. Windows 11 home version is not supported. Windows 11 computer should have network connectivity to reach the local DNS server for name resolution and AD domain controller. For joining Windows 11 computer to AD domain, we need to log in to the computer with local administrator account. We must know our domain name before joining the Windows 11 computer to domain. We will also need an Active Directory users account to join the existing Windows 11 computer to a domain. The computer's local time must be within 5 minutes of the domain controller's time. The proper time synchronization is required for Kerberos authentication. We have already configured the network adapter settings on this computer to get an IP address automatically from the Windows Server 2022 DHCP server. Check out the last video on how to install and configure DHCP server role on Windows Server 2022. Link is provided in the description area. You can click on link provided in the above card to directly go to that video. First, we will make sure that our Windows 11 computer can resolve the domain name and can communicate with the domain controller. Open command prompt by running command cmd. Type command ping msftwebcast.com and press enter key. Here, msftwebcast.com is our local Active Directory domain name. We can see we have ping to msftwebcast.com domain name, but we are getting reply back from the IP address 172.1872.50. So we can confirm that our Windows 11 computer is able to resolve the DNS name to IP address and also able to communicate with our local domain controller. Let me show you the host name of this Windows 11 computer. The host name is win11-vm01. Now we can start domain joining process. There are multiple methods to join Windows 11 computer to a domain. We will pick the easiest method. Open Start menu and select a Settings. Click on Accounts. Click on Access, Work or School. Click on the Connect button. Select Join this device to a local Active Directory domain option. Type in the domain name, which is msftwebcast.com in our case. Once you type the domain name, click on Next. Joining the computer to the domain requires the correct permissions. If our network administrator has given your account access, you can enter your credentials. If not, ask your network administrator to enter their admin credentials to join the device for you. At the moment, we will use the domain admin credentials to join this computer to the domain. Type administrator username administrator at msftwebcast.com Enter administrator password and click on OK. We might see an extra dialog to add an account. However, 
this isn't necessary to join the device to the domain. So click on the skip button. At this point, a computed account should be set up in Active Directory domain. We will need to restart our Windows 11 PC when prompted to do so. Click on Restart Now. We can now log in to this Windows 11 device with our domain user account. To do this, first we need to unlock this Windows 11 computer. Type in domain name slash username or the user principal name. Select other user and enter user account details. Let me type the username administrator at msftwebcast.com. This is our domain admin's user account. Let me enter the password. And under password, we can see sign in to is set to msftwebcast.com. So this will sign in this user to our Active Directory domain. Let's press enter key. This is the first time the domain admin is logging into this Windows 11 computer. So user profile creation process will take few seconds to create a user profile for our domain administrator account. We have successfully logged in to this Windows 11 computer using our domain admin's account. Open settings window. Click on account. Go to access work or school again. Verify that our domain name shows up. In our case, we can see the domain name msftwebcast.com. This Windows 11 computer is connected to msftwebcast Active Directory domain. We can also check the result of the Windows 11 AD join process from Active Directory users and computers. Go back to our domain controller. This is our domain controller. Open run menu and type dsa.msc and press enter key to open Active Directory users and computers snapping. Expand domain name and click on computer's built-in container. We can see the host name of Windows 11 computer win11-vm01. Double click on Windows 11 computer account. We can see the DNS name of this computer account, which is win11-vm01.msftwebcast.com. Click on Operating System tab. Since we are using Windows 11 Enterprise Evaluation copy, we can see the OS name as Windows 11 Enterprise Evaluation. That's all for this video on how to join Windows 11 computer to an Active Directory domain. I hope you found this video helpful and interesting. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.